Hi, welcome back my dear students. In this lecture here, I want to show you how to improve our CMS system by creating a new comment system. It's going to be very simple. It's actually going to be a lot better than what we have before. And let me just show you exactly what we have before or what some of you already have. It's that we what we're doing here is incrementing all right, our field post comment count in our post table by one every time a user makes a comment. All right, we're going to do things a little bit different and actually they're going to be a lot more fun to do. All right, so we're not even going to deal with this. I want you to go to your post.php and I want you to delete this line. Just delete it or if you want, just to have it as a reference, just comment that line out. We're not going to even use it anymore. All right, so my idea is this. Every time we create a comment, all right, all we have to do if we want to show the number, all right, that's being the, the, the amount of comment that we have in our admin right here, is that all we have to do is just count the rows in that specific um, post, and that's it. All right, once we count the rows for this specific ID, for this specific post, we can say, okay, it has three comments, it has four comments. We don't even have to increment that uh, field by one anymore. We don't have to do comment count. So we can even delete that out of our database if we wanted to, our, uh, out of our table. So let me just show you how this works. All right, so go to your view all posts. And we're going to do this right here where we are echoing post comment count. All right. So first, and I got this line right here. I'm going to show you. I'm just going to copy and paste it. Basically, we make a query, right? And we select everything from comments where comment post ID equals the post ID. All right. Remember that that's the, the comment post ID is the one that we are inserting. All right. Right here. That's the comment count, right? Right here. So we are inserting comment post ID, which is actually right here. Sorry. The post ID into the comment post ID. All right. So if these two are similar, right? Well, actually the same, then we make the query, right? So we'll come here and we'll say, you know what? Send query um, count or um, send comment query. All right. Just to make a little bit more uh, semantic or something. So, and then we'll create another variable here and we'll say count comments. Uh, if I can spell it right, that would be nice. There we go. And then all we got to do is use a function here called MySQLite num rows. All right. And we'll use the result set right here. Put it right here. And that's it. All right. Now all we have to do is just echo count comments like this. All right. For this specific user. So now we save it and we go back to our admin and enter. And now you can see that everything is zero. All right. And now we got one right here because we have a comment for this specific user. So for example, if I go to this post right here and I create a comment and I say, okay, my name is Edwin Diaz, support at edwindiaz.com or actually Edwin School of Code. EdwinSchoolOfCode.com. There we go. It's like a really cool website that I'm developing. And just saying something like uh, my comment. All right. Submit. All right. Now we go to admin. We go to post. And now you can see that we have a comment there. All right. And we got two views, of course. It's pretty cool stuff, right? Now, it would be nice if we have a link here. We had a link where we click on this and we can see all the comments for this specific post. We're going to do that in the next lecture. I think you're going to like it. Anyway, thank you so much and I'll see you in the next one.